than just do stuff. And feel free to ask me questions. You can even grab me after the class if you have any particular questions. Okay. When you get there, you're going to see something that looks like this. Everybody raise your hand if you have this already. Good. Okay. This quadrant is named what? HTML. That means we're going to type in HTML here, and I'll explain this in a second. This quadrant, let's see if I move this, if it shows. There we go. If I move my mouse up, away from it, now it shows. What does this show? JavaScript. JavaScript. And then up to the one on the right, CSS. Does anybody know what HTML stands for? I heard it. Started it. Hypertext. That's the first. That's the H. M is? Markup language. Markup language. Hypertext markup language, right? HTML. I want to tell you, look up beginnings of HTML when you get home, okay? Look up how, why it was meant, what it was originally meant for. I'll ask you next time. CSS, anybody know what that stands for? Yeah, that's a little more obscure, right? Cascading style sheets. Cascading style sheets. And cascade, we won't get into that too much in our class, but you can have different, you can have different levels, you can write different levels of CSS in the cascade. But anyway, style sheet. Style, what is style? Anyone you all know this? What style? Is it the color of something? Is it the look of something? Is it the feel of something? Layout, like format. Yeah. Layout, format, style, color, look, feel, right? What is style? Layout, color, look. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I want to know that. I hope you guys Thanks, are alive. Tina. They're a really quiet group. I know. I'm going to bring it out. They're going to talk with me. In JavaScript, I just told you a little bit about, right? This is more, this is more like code, code. These two are a little different than other languages. HTML is used for every single web page. Every single web page that you ever go to is made from HTML. It might be made with something to produce HTML, but it all boils down to HTML. JavaScript's a language that can be run in a browser. Every single modern browser has a JavaScript interpreter in it. And CSS are in modern browsers as well. So this is where we write our sort of our code. Well, I'll show you in a second. We're just going to dive in. This is where we write our style, and this is where we write our interaction. So let's go here. I'm going to start you off, and it's going to, it's going to yell at me because it's going to say it's already in here. But every single HTML5, um, document, I'm just going to start off with HTML. It starts with this and ends with this. And it's going to yap at you. No need for the HTML tag, it's already in the output, but I want you to see it. I want you to tell me some of the things you noticed about HTML already. I'll give you another I'll give you another tag here that I'm going to put inside this HTML sandwich of sorts. Okay? I'm going to put body after that. What are you noticing? Oh. <laughs> I know. It's, isn't it weird when you see it at a 
context like this, you're like, what is that? I know it. Yeah, or you could just do this and I'll understand what you're saying because something you did. Yes. So you notice that, right? Hmm. If I were to tell you, I, there's a tab. There's a tab. These are all called tabs. They're also called elements. Called H1. How would you tell me how to write that given our given this given this pattern? I have an HTML tag. I have a body tag. Now I want to put in an H1 tag. Can you tell me how I might write this? Where would you put it? Yeah, I just want to know. I'm going to put it right here. Yeah, I'm going to put it right here. How? Go ahead. Less than, and then what? Because I can't see. Then I'm just listening H1. to you. H1. And then greater than. Greater than. Mm -hmm. And then. Two speed. And then what? Below. Like enter. 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 Then oh. enter. Mm -hmm. Make it even. How do, okay, so I should backspace. And then what, what do I do? What's the next character? Uh, less than. Less than. Forward slash. Forward slash. H1. H1. Uh, Great, good. good. You guys Yay. got it. Well, like Ignore that for a second. To open and to close it. The backslash tells it to close. So you can do symbols like 